Okay, let's do one final mirror check before I leave for the party. Looking good if I say so myself. Ugh, really? Amy's mirror is so high, I can only see my eyes. How am I supposed to put on my lipstick? Come on, bottom lip! Get in there! Something tells me jumping the lipstick in hand won't end well. Seriously, how can you even see what you're doing? See? Told you it wouldn't end well. Unless you're headed off to a clown party. Ooh, look who's a splashing and a splashing in the bath! Oh, hey, Mr. Rubber Ducky! You're never too old to play with bubbles, either. Sophia has room to do everything in here. Amy's bath looks a little different than Sophia's. There's way more zen going on in here. But long legs means a tighter fit. Sorry, Amy. Alright, time to suds up and get ready for the day. See you later, bathrobe! If you're Sophia's height, you probably never think about whether or not you'll fit in a shower. See? Her hair gets wet in record time! And when it comes time to lather up, things are a piece of cake. Hey, that stuff smells amazing. Is that mango? Yum! Amy's showers, however, look a little different. Can't this thing go any higher? Come on, move it on up! Gah! Looks like Amy's doing another round of shower squats this morning. Yep, and down we go. When you're as tall as Amy, showering becomes more of a delicate dance than a cleaning sesh. It's all about getting under the shower head at just the right angles. Ouch! That kinda hurt. That's it. I'm saving up for a bathroom remodel starting today. Grrr. By the time you're done with your shower, you're exhausted. And you thought showers were supposed to be relaxing? Whatever. So I really need a couple new pieces for my vacation coming up. Hey, check out these awesome colors! This is perfect! Yes, let's go try these suckers on, shall we? Whoa, Amy is feeling herself in this red number. Yowza, girl! You're looking fabulous! But where did all that wind come from? How about your outfit, Sophia? <sighs> surprise, surprise, this dress is made for a much taller gal than me. And that's why so many short girls resort to shopping in the kids section. I'll take one of each, please. One of the great things about having a best friend is hanging out after school. And even better, they let you have free reign over their wardrobe. Wow, Amy's stuff is so cute! I wonder if she has anything I could borrow for the party Saturday night. Ooh, these denim shorts are super adorable! Just remember, though, your much taller friend's clothes may look a little different on you than they do on them. But they're just jean shorts. How different could they be? I'm gonna give them a try. Hey, Amy, would you mind if I borrow these jean shorts? I think I could totally rock them on Saturday. Pretty, please? Sure, I don't say why not. Really? Yes, I'm gonna be the hit of the party! Well, if you say so, Sophia. Uh, is it just me or did these things look a lot smaller on the hanger? Yep, Sophia definitely didn't take her and Amy's drastic height difference into account. Jeez, I could fit two of me in here! Well, Amy, at least you don't have to worry about Sophia stealing any of your clothes. There's no shortage of short kid trouble in school, either. Hey, could someone help Sophia out? She can't reach. Almost. Got it. Okay, maybe I just need to try a new approach. Ooh, fail. Hey, Amy, can you lend a hand? Sure, no problem. Man, she makes it look so easy. Here you go. Yep, she literally just pet me. Awesome. Yes, art class. The best period of the day. Seriously? Why are these desks so darn small? Unfortunately for tall girls like Amy, these school desks never seem to have enough leg room. See? I can barely even cross them. Ugh, it's no use. Well, I guess I'll just sit here, uncomfortably, for an hour. Actually, no! I'm not going to stand for this nonsense any longer. I'm using my long legs to break free from these teeny tiny desks. It looks like you really have to pee. Laugh it up, Sophia. I'm serious. Careful, Amy. You're gonna hurt yourself. Man, look at those things go. Oh no, your pencils! 
Oops. Well, at least I got some more leg room. Problem solved. Whoa, how many legs are on that thing? Gross. Oh, hey, Amy. Way to show up. You're 20 minutes late to class. Looks like your lab partner doesn't mind. Supermodel alert. Looking good. Hey, thanks for saving me a seat, dude. What's up? Wow, did you get all these equations on your own? You are so smart. I can't believe it. Yeah, chemistry's kind of my jam. Well, looks like these lab partners are a match made in heaven. Hey, what's in this guy? Careful, it's really hot. Oh, oops. Wow, do these guys have chemistry or what? Oh yeah, that's the look of love, all right. Hey, class is almost over. Wanna go get ice cream or something? But before you go off on your date, you may want to make sure you two are on the same level. Tall girl struggles. Am I right? You look a lot shorter sitting down. And you look taller sitting at your desk. And just like that, you lost a potential boyfriend. Aw, sorry, Amy. Yes, it's finally girls' night. Sweet movies, ladies. Mia's bro wants to take a pic. Quick, pose! Hey, wait! I want to be in the shot, too! Oh, that's not good. Excuse me, guys! Little lady coming through. Amy, get in the shot! Oh, now we have the opposite problem. You can't even see Amy's pretty blue eyes. She does not look happy. Well, A for effort, I guess. Another Friday night, another lame party. Hey, Amy, wanna dance? What about you, Sophia? Wanna dance with me? Yikes, this party is going downhill fast. Wait, I know exactly what to do to liven this up. Who wants to play a fun game of limbo? Yes, I love this game! I'll hold this end and Bella can go first. Show us what you got, girl! Woohoo! While limbo can be a super fun party game, it can come a little easier to some than others. And unfortunately, it has a lot to do with height. Ooh, watch your nose! Yikes, you really went hard there, Amy. Let's see if Sophia can be a little more graceful during her turn under the limbo stick. Don't worry, guys. I totally got this. Alright, Sophia. Show us what you got. What? She doesn't even have to bend back at all. Boom, baby. I told you I was the limbo master. You guys are walking pretty quickly. Are you sure you can keep up, Sophia? Wait, can you repeat that? I can't hear you. God, I'm sweating like a pig here. I really love the way… Hey, Sophia, where'd you go, girl? Oh, I'm fine. Just trying to keep up with those long legs of yours. For every step a tall person takes, a shorter person has to take two. You can do it, Sophia. Ever get in the car and realize you're too short to drive it? Sophia has felt this way once or twice. Ugh. A pillow should help. Okay, so far so good. But all this scooting and sliding around isn't good for driving. Oh, man. Okay, this better work. Yeah, now we're talking. Ooh, being able to reach the pedals is kind of necessary for driving. Aw, don't cry, Sophia. You still have time to catch the bus. But when Amy gets in the car, it's a whole other story. Oh, man. Who'd they make this car for, ants? I can barely even sit up straight. Oh yeah, that's definitely not a good look. Wait a second. This car has a sunroof. Ugh, sweet relief. Hey, how's the weather up there, Amy? Catch it on the flip. Oh man, I'm so tired I could fall asleep right on this couch. Ugh. I can't stretch my legs. Maybe if I lay my head down like this? Nope, this isn't working. If you're tall, you definitely understand the struggle of the love seat snuggle. No matter what position you lie in, you'll just never be comfortable enough. Man, that was a long day. Oh, couch, how I've missed you. I'm just gonna curl up for a few minutes. One hour tops. Hey, mind if I reach over you for a sec? Nope, not there. Aha! I found my chips! 
Hey! When you're short, you don't have to worry about leaving the cupboard open. Ow! Tall people simply don't have that luxury.